Yoshiki locked into? We'll see here. All right, going right into it. Kirby, the green Kirby too, the tactical. Immediately taking to the sky, you of know, course. Kirby excels on that top platform with uh, Yoshi's limited options to get up there, but... Yoshi is showing a very uh, good presence of Wizzy's openings when he just fast fall down airs and like that. Very bold move. There it is again. And it doesn't look like much is happening as Wizzy escapes, but all of that damage adds up to be a lot in this matchup as as, as soon as Wizzy's off stage, if he's at armor break percent from back air and air, which really isn't that high, Yoshi will be able to find that stock. And the thing about this too is um, Wizzy has kind of developed this new style of uh, double jumping uh, up to top platform and through using his armor because drills won't break his, uh, his shield until, you know, well, they won't break it. Uh, and uh, it seems that Kiyoshi's caught on to this in the past games and is doing a really good job of knowing when to use his aggression. Wizzy playing amazing at the ledge. I'll just, I just want to throw that out there. Definitely spacing extremely well. Yeah, he hasn't sealed the KO yet, but... Whoa. Wizzy's wow. face was... Gets the trade after that. Wonder, yeah. You gotta wonder if it was a bait or if he was going for something or going for a hard read. I really don't know. Wizzy takes that top platform, but... That's that double jump through the top platform, and now he has control. Takes a few percent for it, but it's mm -hmm. definitely worth it if he can have that kind of positioning. Because he can take the stock if he does have it. There's that back area. Yeah, yeah, excellent edge guard. There's those Wizzy edge guards we're so used to seeing. He doesn't let Kirby have any forgiveness. If he upbees in his face, and he could spell the end. Yep. Big opening for Wizro. Easy combo, unfortunately. Good counter for Kyoshi. Kyoshi is out, and good armor. Good parry there. Yoshi now an armor break percent from that back as we just Shield. saw and it. Yeah, Wizzy did try to uh, meet him out there with the aerial, but there good down is. smash to finish there. Yep. Wizzy up a stock, has 100%. It's a dangerous spot for Yoshi. Can't really get away with the uh, too much racking up of damage anymore, which is kind of uh, Yoshi's in, unfortunately. So right now, Wizzy's just trying to avoid any, any strong hit that's going to break his shield, but he's trying to pick his battles. Definitely telling Kiyoshi there, I'm, pa I'm very patient. I'm gonna. Ooh, Good DI. Forward tilt there. Yeah, off for the back yes. air and will still the KO. Wizro going up three stocks to one. Excellent combo. He is moving and grooving. And he hasn't got hit since that that time I mentioned. Oh, he's, at, he's at armor break percent. He and played so seems well. The last two times he's been hit, he's actually lost his stock for it. So I think it's easy for, easier for Wizro to, uh, to imagine that he really can't afford to be hit. Yeah. But one wrong move as Yoshi, as, uh, as Yoshi and you're, you're dead. Was he just trying to uh, pick out his landing spots with those up airs to try to meet him there? Perhaps get a nice trade there. Double jumps up there. He's on low percent again, so he can get away with this. Excellent read with the falling down there. Is he just taking his space? He says, I'm safe down here, I'm fine. And as soon as he commits to anything, goes back up to the top platform again. It's the poke war, of, really. Yeah, yeah exactly. It was just. Uh, the spacing war of, you know, if you want to actually land a hit, you have to sacrifice your positioning and I'm going to punish you for that. Four tilt Nair and yeah, Ford Air, and that's going to be game one. Two stocks. What does he have remaining? Taco's coming up. Taco's with a few words. This is like a, where it starts to add a, a good amount of time if each player is taking a minute between each game. That's why in other games, such as like Smash 4, you've seen it to where each player only gets one timeout per set. And that is where you really got to use your coaching to its most of its advantage. But 64 has the liberty of coaching um, just freely, basically, outside the time limit. Exactly. Seems to give him a few advice here. We'll see if they're uh, restricting him on time. But No help for Kyushke. No Fukuro you know, in perhaps, sight. Perhaps, uh, yeah, perhaps Fukuro's not around. Oh, he's actually right behind me. And uh, I think he might have some... I have enough confidence in his, in his compadre. And it, yeah, and it could be a situation of like friends but rivals at the same time. It's like if you want to win, you gotta earn it. And that might well, just I believe he's happy to give moment. advice, but uh, perhaps yeah. you know we're not exactly sure how open Kyoshi is to it. Yeah. How much he wants it, how much he needs it. I don't know. know what the um, what the uh, standard is in Japan. Is it not it, allowed? There could be some pride to it as well. Yeah. That he wants to you yeah. know earn For, it the same way as it would back yeah. then. Yeah. Very possible, but we won't know. We won't know. And uh, 
Wizzy do an excellent job of just kind of tricking Kiyoshi to move it, uh, move into non-dominant spaces so that he can take that top platform again mm -hmm. and, and uh, really control the flow of this match. Wizzy gives it up, though. Yeah, he does give it up to try to uh, coax Kiyoshi into doing some sort of option that's not Such a good weight official. for yep. Reverse back air to Nair. Good coverage there, and that back air is going to be a little bit too early. Ooh, Ooh just the eye. The eye. Yeah. Text in place, which can be risky in that situation where you're right in the opening of the two platforms. That's like the opportunity where Yoshi can drop down and punish you even farther, but exactly. Wizard not able to make it there in time. That's the uh, just due to the Tekken place in general being a uh, having a shorter window. But it is riskier with the positioning. Was he trying to challenge now in the, in the air with the eggs? But excellent back air won't seal it. But we'll see what he can do to edge guard. Using those eggs to try to force position and misses the back air and gets yeah. thrown for it. But this is a Z cancel. Throw it back. Wow, excellent quick turnaround into egg. It was all falling. You, you usually only see that on the rise. Very uh, good, very good presence of mind from Wizzy. And Kyushiki there. Hits him with the weak bear to not send him away at a bad angle for Yoshi as well. And then he doesn't go for the armor break or anything. Just grabs ledge. Doesn't give Yoshi a chance to retaliate. Just great patience in that regard too. And going for the grabs, he knows that that's going to be the... Grabs don't care about armor. So yep. you can always grab there. Ooh, very close interactions. And Wizzy comes out with the, uh, the armor nair. Forward air, not going to link to anything. Almost had enough hits. A lot of percent. Yeah, Wizzy yeah. believed. Knew he can save the challenge. Wizzy just playing keep away, throwing out a lot of aerials. It's a trade. Uh, good, good trade there, especially for for Wizzy. Evening it up for the most part. Still a not ideal percentage. No, not at all. But Wizzy definitely is uh, pretty aware of percents that'll break his uh, his armor. Ooh, tries to up tilt. Just drill for it. Coming out. This is that armor break percent. Oh, but gets oh, the weak gets the bear. Weak Wizzy hit. with an opportunity to take the stock lead. Can he bring the pressure yeah, at the tilt. ledge? Oh. A lot of shield pressure there. Catches it coming out. Breaks it, but actually gets it back on stage. Oh, two hits. Rising and falling there. Wizzy with the pressure gets grabbed. Making the comeback with the Nair. Four tilt. I like Nair. the aggressive recovery and there with the Nair. Up. Yeah, definitely like it. You have to challenge sometimes because yeah. otherwise that's kind of the mix up with grab as well. If they throw out the grab, you can uh, throw out an aerial and it'll stuff the grab. So, huge K running away with this game. Trying to take another one here with the armor break. Good parry by Wizzy. Wizzy feeling comfortable at the, the ledge like that. Try to, do the, does the, uh, try to do the double jab there to knock him off, but it didn't work. Kyushuke so aware, just throws out the instant back air from the, to punish him for pushing him off the, the ledge. Ooh, as he reaches for the forward air. Risky down B. And that up smash will take the kill. Even worse position as he was up a, a stock last time, or evened up the stocks last time. But, ooh, let's see what this... Uh, how this stock goes. Up uh, forward air. Extending the combo. That'll be an up air. Yeah, that combo enough. extension is still not going to be enough. Wizzy, okay, it's brought it back. They're both at percent. Definitely evening out that percent, yeah. Both needs the strong hits. Wizzy playing it very smart, sticking next to the side of the platforms. Getting that push off, it's not going to do any damage. Wizzy in a bad spot, he needs to get out of the corner. You never want to put yourself in that position. Yeah, it seems to, to act well out of it, but it's definitely not a favorable spot. Was he searching for this back air up air to just yeah. get this stock lead and just have a sigh of relief? And Ooh, there it is. And the There's al that almost random up air. Yeah. But calculated. Calculated for sure. Definitely He's calculated. They've been picking up on each other's habits, finding how they move throughout the air. There's that single hit from Kiyoshi. Pressures him into trying to be aggressive off, off ledge again and, uh, and dies from one hit. Wizrobe showing so much respect, does not even challenge him. He Absolutely. actually retreats away from the ledge just because he didn't want to end up in a scramble over by the edge over there. He's only taking it if it's almost guaranteed. He definitely has maximum respect for his opponent. Let's snipe out with the up airs. Wiz is doing a good job of just trying to earn the space by, uh, by this point. He's just, trying to, he's just teasing him. Kiyoshi 
big opportunity. It. Go, okay, goes for the hard the there. That's a lot of percent. Gets just, with the egg, no follow up. Yeah, double jump egg. Just to make a tricky like trajectory almost. Because you're not used to seeing Yoshi's choose that option. He just flew at that downward angle to the ledge. I like it. A risky one, but definitely one that is, uh, you know, you have to take a risk to throw somebody off. Yeah. Not predict uh, your moves. Did he use his double jump? He no, did. but that's unfortunate. Yeah. He does try the egg again, and yeah. Yoshi's there with the down tilt. And, uh... Taco's coming up for a few more words. Yeah, I definitely feel like if he went high there, Kyoshke was not in position to cover it. But if he was, then Wizard was kind of kind of done for. It, so it's definitely a scary situation. Almost a 50-50, and Wizard just takes the wrong option. He picked the wrong door. Absolutely. Seems that uh, Wizard's taking some of his advice to heart. We'll see if he can uh, change his, his game. Trying to uh, <laughs> decipher what Tacos is pantomiming over there. What is he telling? Yeah. Me? He's probably actually finding out what he's saying. Maybe I have some visual barriers. Can we get some uh, two TVs going? We'll save that for top six. Yeah. Yes, he might be, uh, he might be wanting. Up. He might be wanting a timer here. Oh yeah, look at look. <laughs> He's uh, looking uh. at the camera. Looking at them. Looking at the camera. Looking at them. Time. Yeah, one minute, man. It's a one minute timer. Yes. Yeah. Not one minute left. Exactly. How? Oh, one minute left. Oh, more coaching. Yep. Not quite. I think uh, Kiyoshi's done waiting. He's definitely, he definitely knows his time. It's one one now. This is a big swing because whoever is up two one, the other person has to win two straight, which is never fun. It's really the bad position to be in. This is a big turning point, and uh, especially at the beginning of this match, how how this match starts out is the same thing. Now Kyo should be going for a little uh, higher approach as it seems. He wants to deny Wizzy the, the top platform like he's been trying to take over so easily, but doing multiple jumps over top platform now. He goes up there again. He knows when Wizzy wants it. Good up there from Wizzy. Just escapes so cleanly. And we've talked about the top platform a lot, and I feel like they both are using that, like the, the whole strategy we've been talking about. Only in the first like stock or two of the game, and then it just becomes freestyle almost after that. Spacing on each other like all over the combo. stage. We'll I'm liking it a turn lot. Into, waits for the tech and he gets waited up for the tech. He waits for the read, that. yeah. And that yeah. down B will seal it. Good conversion from Wizzy. And that does seem to be the, the trend though is to uh, convince your opponent that you are gonna have this strategy and mm -hmm. then you're gonna flip it up on them and then you start to start being aggressive. But and they're almost doing laps around the stage. We see so many interactions happening on all the platforms, all the sides of the stage. Definitely just going with the flow of the match. Yeah, and it's, uh, it's a bit of responding to how your opponent's acting and also just having your own game plan like yeah. here. And it's just showing the uh, the prominence of like their awareness and stage control. They can, because we've seen like just control from both of them on all sides of the stage. It's not just one trick pony. Oh, I can control the top line. You can't do anything about it. We see all kinds of pressure, like battle of the minds. Exactly, on ledge here as well. He chooses that egg once again. He's and starting I, to read the, the eggs, yeah. and the eggs are not they're not safe, and instead you, it leaves you open to uh, to edge guards that are a lot easier when you would normally be able to pass fall. But that's that kind of the, uh, the um, between two evils kind of thing of this matchup is like either yeah. I'm going to egg and like hope to get this recovery or he's just going to break my armor and I'm going to die. Anyway. Like you know, oh, and he calls it again with again, the down air. He can't do it, but he's just he so afraid of getting his stop armor with those eggs. Yeah, yeah, he really does. He really needs to stop doing that because Kiyoshi's reading it every time and just throwing out a move. Down tilt, down air. At this point, he could just start picking. He really could. He could tilt. He could rapid you know, jab. Exactly. <laughs> pick your poison and that is the, that's the dunk to even back up again. Good job from Wizzy catching that combo. Yeah. So despite having that read on Wizzy's recovery and him not making the most of it, it's just Wizzy still claws his way back every time. And his positioning is pretty great. I think he's going for top off from there, but it's good to cover it. And it's this air battle again where they're just fighting for that space and Wizzy's respecting him against the side platform, but he wants that in. Yep. Oh, it throws out the, the riskiest of DJCs and lost his armor for it, but uh, live. 
And we talked about this matchup being bad and, and a lot about the top platform, of course. And I mean, historically, it's been Yoshi struggles with pressuring the top platform when Kirby is just hanging out up there. Yeah, his yeah, jump. But Wizzy is so good at making it seem like if you're not perfect, you will get punished hard for this. It doesn't matter if you're on the top plat. Exactly. It's a very, very different wizard. I mean, that back air to F smash. And that's what Wizzy's been afraid of. That's why he's opting for the egg, yeah, just to yeah. hold for a little bit of coverage to prevent him. But Kyoshi playing around it every time, and now he's plays around so the quickly. He's, yeah. he's realized his habits and is uh, is changing his game plan phenomenally. Wizzy's trying a lot of the same mold, but he's uh, kind of fine tuning it to start landing those hits. We said we've seen that he's. Landed two very clean uh, combos of it. Ooh, and that shield break. And that backer hits it the wrong way. It was a very it interesting in setup. I don't know how much of it was on purpose yeah, or what he was really a, trying quite to Quite a bit do. of it was an accident, yeah. yeah. That poke, yeah, yeah there's that grab that again. Poke, and in yeah. J version, that, what Kyoshi is used to, that sends Yoshi more horizontal, uh, which would help him in this matchup even more. But Absolutely, we saw that from Fupro earlier. What a kill, but yep. ooh, and that ledge hog will, that's gonna take it. It's game three. That's okay, taking the game lead. That's who won. Gotta wonder if Wizzy's uh, looking a little worried right now. The pressure must be building. Never gonna be down in this uh, scenario because it could be your last game and you might have, you know, might have to win that one and another one afterwards, mm -hmm. so. Um, keeping her mentality right is, is huge in this. Absolutely. Especially fighting such a monster like Yoshiki, you have to uh, have to calm those nerves. Yoshiki, Yoshiki gives a wave to the camera. And the peace sign, his signature. Been seeing that a lot. <laughs> he rolled his eyes. <laughs> He's loving it. He's like, oh, well, here we go. Another uh, in between every game. Yeah, yeah. Keep an eye on the timer, perhaps, and make sure Takas isn't up there too long. We're up. About 45 seconds. Tacos cuts it short. Says his Respectable. Piece. Yep. Respectable. He's keeping an eye on that timer himself. Maybe. You know, and that just gives Wizzy a little bit more time to internalize as well and uh, perhaps apply that knowledge. All right. Looks like Wizzy's just about ready. She's like, you better tell him how to fix his recovery, dog. Yeah. <laughs> he he's definitely needs to work on that because he's Kiyoshi's really has seemed to figure out the, the mix-up game between when Wizzy's going to just try to go straight for the ledge and when he's going to try to egg. And uh, he's been on top of him for all of it. Last game ending with two stocks remaining. And this is a top eight qualifier. It's a pretty big deal. I mean, even though only top six is in the theater on Sunday, top eight is still quite the accomplishment. You definitely want to secure that spot in winners. Let's Absolutely. see. Can Wizzy find it? Here's this top platform game. No one overextending in the beginning, but Wizzy sneaks in. Play very safe. Ooh. He might have, yeah, he did use his jump. And the safety rock. The safety rock. Two extremely patient players. They both know the, the gravity of each movement and interaction between them. He makes it through. Again, Yoshi taking a sacrifice of percent every time he takes advantage of position. Very hard to just dominate position and, and uh, keep Kirby off the top lap level. Because he's got to get past the wall, but he keeps ending up in these bad spots. Kiyoshi playing actually oh, phenomenal. Trade there, yeah, and Kiyoshi running away before he throws out that back air to make sure that he uh, throws out the aerial in time but that the armor ends. This game so far has really been almost a perfect exemplification of this matchup as a lot of people know it. Absolutely, and it's yeah. just, you can't catch me, and if you do try to fight me, I'm going to win the interactions quick with Wizzy. Quick see Ariel to run off forward there. Yep. That's going to be what he needs to and close these stocks early. Exactly. Don't let Kirby get any more than he, he deserves, really. Yeah, definitely you can't give him any slack to cause you give him an inch, he'll take a mile. with the bread and butter. Just keep away with back air. Take your space. Tries to approach with the forwarder there. Again, trying to keep that safe space because he knows that if he misses at all with an aerial or doesn't land it uh, before Kirby's able to act, then that stock is over. 
sending him off stage, and now he's at armor break percent. Uh, but Backer again, the U version forward throw doesn't send him very horizontally, mostly vertically. So I might be wrong about this, but I believe uh, Kirby back throw it. Uh, uh, also sends more ver uh, horizontally as oh, well. Does it? Okay. That, that may have been a way better idea in Japanese version. Yeah. That up tilt. Change the up tilt. See if we can keep him off. Yeah, Yoshi the 2 has been KO'd straight up by it, but every hit, her, every hit really hurts Ooh. now. That should KO on the top platform. And Kiyoshi reacted that um, that when Wizzy hit him and ran off of the uh, side platform there, that he was going to catch him on the way back with a grab. Very, very quick reactions out of Kiyoshi. Was he trying to the sneaky, uh, the sneaky nair, but Yoshi ready for him, and these drills are really adding up. Yeah, they really are. This could be a KO, but Ooh, amazing DI. DI from in from Kiyoshi has saved him multiple times now. Was he cannot rely on that? Unfortunately, it's such a basic combo for Yoshi. No more armor for Yoshi. He can rely on that up till being fixed knockback. Yep. Kirby's back here gonna take out the armor now, unless it's just stale enough. Oh, it's not really good. Spot to be in. Wizzy, oh, he, he him. makes it Puts back. Puts on stage though, good DI up. Last chance for Wizzy. Finds another life. You have to take two clean stocks at 135%. Yeah, he's gotta in this. play pretty much literally perfectly. Yeah, there's no room for error. One error could be the, the entire game, the entire set here. There's some killers in this loser's bracket. Oh, there will be, and it's going to be a bloodbath. Was he really? Has he, he has the time. He's got four minutes. Yeah, you know, he's, he's got four minutes and, and uh, a dream. Can't force anything. Definitely cannot force it. Except, he is happy to five. sit there as well. He says, you have to come to me still. And I, I know you can't afford to, uh, yeah. to not as well. He has quite the advantage here, so if it, if it were to go to time, that would be all Kiyoshi, but we're quite a ways off of that. Okay. Only the trigger. Yeah, that going to ledge was just not a good idea because yeah. Yoshi's so limited, but okay, takes his takes his damage and runs away with him. it. That could be a combo. Big Nair. opening. Okay, and Yoshi it's even up here last in stocks, but percent is very dangerous. And it he's is. one hit away. But he played that so perfectly, even like a fresh stock on Kiyoshi. He just needs one more. He needs to do it one more this. time. One opening. And he will play it the same way. Well, really, he needs a couple openings because he needs to find his pokes first. He needs a, a little bit of percent. Little he can't percent. just get away with uh, zero for the most part. Three minutes on the clock. Oh, bad spot again. He puts himself at the oh, ledge. Good escape. Really good escape. And that's a very bad spot. Oh. Very close aerial. Both these players on the edge of their seat. Koshke, though, looking a little more composed. Actually, was he pretty composed, too? Honestly, he hasn't he looks rushed focused. anything. He looks extremely yeah. focused. He's not. He knows like what he has it. to do. Playing it right. I think he, uh, Wizzy would prefer to get an up air at this point. Just to get a couple of chip damage without risking too much. But, uh, there's a lot more to be desired there. Creeping in on the space. Just and inching just his way him. closer. And just teasing to him. He's going to jump out and back Two and, and a half minutes on the clock. I wouldn't, I mean, if I Wizzy mean, doesn't maybe. force anything. Yoshi never has to approach. Oh, close one there. Oh, there's that he little bit of percent. Hit. He got the little percent. Oh, oh, and that could have been it. And he uses and that's going to be it. Yoshi perfectly baited him. You know, yeah. he, after he was he got that hit in, he's probably thinking, all right, he's probably pretty happy about that. He's going to get a little trigger happy, go 